This is going to end bad. I mean, just like Syria. Sergeants Anderson and Maddox? Yes, sir. We've got a major shit sandwich shaping up in Bosnia. And as the best sniper spotter team Benning has to offer, you two are about to take the first bite. The city of Sarajevo is under siege by Serbian forces. We're getting reliable reports of widespread atrocities, mostly thanks to this son of a bitch, Major Marko Vladek. Vladek's death squads have been systematically eradicating the civilian population in the Starigrad district. With all due respect, sir, why is this asshole still breathing? NATO won't take action till they can show the news cameras proof positive of Vladek's war crimes. The Grim Reaper's on the loose, and you're sending us in to play paparazzi? What you will do is rendezvous with a CIA asset on the ground. A local hustler, name of Marinov. He'll take you where you need to go. Get Vladek's dirty work on film, then extract with the evidence. What if we run into Vladek? You have your orders, Sergeant. Get those pictures, then we can talk about Vladek. Understood? Yes, sir. Good hunting, gentlemen. Parachute in! Oh, you're parachuting. I thought you were in like a. Now it makes more sense. Like crash like teleporter. Oh, look at that. Seems like it was right, part of the plan. Who is he? Just a two-bit hunter. Just get to heck up. No big deal. Now we are. I don't. You haven't seen the the, the intro of this, but now we're back in 1993 in Sarajevo, which I believe is in Russia. We're with Maddox. To evidence, you mean? That guy's Maddox. Hold up. Armor 12 o'clock. I digress. <laughs> yep, now we get regular binoculars. Oh! Look at that, look at the detail on that tank. Take Fantastic. notice though, the enemies have helmets. Now the one fixing the armor's engine, right side. Same Just keep that in mind, because now headshots so become a gamble. Meets in the heart of a war zone. Oh, yeah. They bury bodies in the woods. Anyway. That little like trot he does down this mountain. <laughs> From what I hear, the guy's <laughs> insisted we RV at that specific location. Mentioned we can get jumps over the log. Just jumps over the log oh, for yes. no reason. <laughs> see one dead guy in the window, first floor of that house. I hear you. Nice shot, part. One thing I do like though in this game is like when you shoot through windows, they crack. Like I, li I like that. This is kind of a Point. Cover my thing that I like. Like where the bullet goes? Yeah, it's it's the little details that that matter. About time I got a piece of the action. Just <laughs> look at his expression. Oh, so funny. There, it's, there's huttable secret whatever. But did you see that that desk like that desk just kind of flicker for a second there? Yeah. Stop our ghost warrior. <laughs> First mark on the left side of the building, having a smoke. End it. See? Fuck. Oh. See? That would still hurt like a bitch, though. That would kill you. Helmets don't really, like, help with bullets nowadays. Yeah. Good job. Even though Maddox does help you. 
No, so I didn't. Oh, I think I healed myself. That's why my health is full. Cause I was like, what? Did I not die from this? <laughs> Patrol incoming. Oh shit! Follow my lead. This this little bit vaguely, very vaguely reminds me of Half Life. Just the scenery with the trains and everything. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Oh, this kind of reminds me of Modern Warfare. Where you're like, that's true too. Oh, oh. Flicker. Yep, that happens quite a bit with this game. And I think it's just because it might be because of fraps. It might be because of the game. I don't know. He's pretty obviously sticking out there. Yeah. They do. They do. Just looked right at him. Mm -hmm. Did you see that? Mm hmm. There's no way, like, not one person wouldn't be able to see see us in this. At least him. You, I'd argue, maybe. If you didn't move and just kind of, like, laid there still. Maybe. Maybe. Well, that I think we'd all be a little bit more, like, imagine ourselves to be a little bit more perceptive, though. If you're gonna be a soldier, you should probably be able to notice a dude just laying on the tracks in the open, in the middle of the day. Yeah. Especially since they seem to be, like, patrolling. But I guess trains, underneath trains, doesn't really count as their patrol route. Oh. I, I think he died by the time you just took him to the ground. Well, he didn't stab him, we just tackled him to the feet and then stabbed him. Well, yeah, but dude, he didn't move after he stabbed him. I, I, I guess technically. Seems they're moving into the city. Gotta close this deal fast. Big guns, don't we? Oh, I should mention, we're here to take pictures of this guy who's committing genocide. Which is, a, which is a subject that you really want Sniper Ghost Warrior 2 to handle. You know, a game with subtlety and tact. <laughs> Let's just go assassinate Hitler. Leave him, he's overexposed. Pretty much. Well, you could do that in Sniper Elite V2, and it was that's, awesome. Oh. I, I, that sounds awesome. At least, I mean, at least the bushes and stuff move when you're in them. Yeah. Even though they're all like the plants and stuff are just 2D, <laughs> but I mean that's that's forgivable. Like most games do that. It's not really a, a yeah. fault of Sniper Sniper Ghost Warrior Two. Careful. So just not a lot of killing in this part, which is detrimental to the over overall enjoyment of this of this game since that's all you do in this game is shoot people. Follow me. Where are they running off to? I don't know, they're awfully quick to get somewhere. They got secret nope, it's just a, a shack. <laughs> they're plethora of So dead saw me and you'd think you like, who is this guy sprinting? I don't recognize him. Maybe we should do something about this. Nope. Nope. Too lazy. He's all the way over there. Contact up front. Take him out. Like what? Oh, I guess there is some battle going on over there, but oh, okay. I thought he was like I thought he was getting all uppity cuz he was trying to take cover. Oh no. Yeah, I didn't realize he was repairing something. I was about to say like I guess there's battles going on in the distance, but that guy's a little too far away to be like freaking out about it. But nope. J just repair. Yeah, we're, like, there's no, there's no immediate battle on going right here. Smoke. Yeah. Would have blown over by now. Let's just cross it as fast as possible. Oh fuck on the ground. Oh fuck. Oh fuck on the ground. And <laughs> 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 so behind us collapsed, and like, that's a close call. Close call. You were way, you were very far clear of that. He, he didn't even look back to like. Was that you that said that or him? Which, that was a close call. That was us. Yeah. Together. Step it up a notch. Or no, that was us. Like the, as in Anderson. Okay. I guess we're talking as if we're uh, this for Anderson. <laughs> like, the royal we kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah, that dude. That dude went. 
flip ten like backflip. But I go ahead and check. I'm like, did he do that? Yeah, he he did a backflip. <laughs> <laughs> Looks pretty goddamn painful for that instant of like pain, you know. Yeah. So here comes this part. Probably remnants of noise in the Air Force trying to get I a can't... foothold. Someone did a really poor job on AA audio leveling. Loaded. Yeah, that's really loud. It's right. Which I mean, it it is supposed to be because like it's, it's anti-air anti guns. And there's like a war, but you can't hear Maddox. He's like screaming. You're like, what are you saying? I'm right next to you. So your objective is to take out the anti-air guns, and they notice right away when their buddy dies. <laughs> I, die. I die here. I don't try. I think I've died like once per video, except for the last one. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Did you die the first? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I, I think. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. During uh, your own little operation shitstorm, we get fuck up the double shot. Remnants of Croatian Air Force trying to get a foothold. Yep. There's been nuts flying in so low into the AA gunner's noses. Those dudes just ate it. Yeah, you can you can hear Max a little bit better, but like. It's it's just really hard to hear. Him. I could have gone for that double kill, but I missed yeah, yeah, yeah. the opportunity. Doesn't really matter though, I take care of it. Taking care of business. Urban sniper. <laughs> and then you guys gotta plant C4 on these AA guns. Only because you don't want to get bombed Charge by the planes set. that are flying overhead. Here's a sweet explosion! AA crew dispatched! It's a clip active. So there are three AA guns. That you gotta do. So wait, you don't want to get bombed by the planes? By the, yeah, by the, the, by the pilot, by those. You don't want to get bombed, so you got to take out the AA gun so they stop bombing this location. But oh, okay, okay. I guess the game didn't want you to do three of them, so they just take out they take out one for you. Dead. And here comes the amazing powers of the pistol. Be because... Double kill with the pistol. Oh gosh. It's just as good as a sniper rifle. That's pretty... As I meant, I forgot to mention, I, I am pretty sure there is like the one or two people that are going through this entire game sniping with a pistol. Well, it's kind of, I mean, we're in, in sections where you can, because... I, I mean, I mean, you, you know there's the one kid that's like, I'm just, I'm just gonna do this all day. I'm late. Yeah. <laughs> the kid, the guy is doing like 360 no scopes. <laughs> Yeah. 360 no, or like 360 quick scopes, whatever you want to call them. I don't really play in Modern Warfare 2 or Call of Duty in general. If, if I do if, own one of them, <laughs> or, I think if, I own like two of them actually. If if anybody's watching this and wants to go try and do that, I I would love go if for you do it. it. Go for it. I I would I would laugh. I think. This is a primo hiding spot though with these all three open windows. All that lighting. You think you think at least one person would notice? <laughs> you guys are moving around too. Him at least. Yeah, he, he doesn't seem to understand. The dogs. The dog gets us. I, but I'm pre. I'm 100% certain that's scripted. Possibly. Because he's like, oh, I need to go plant this stuff. So I'm. Yeah. Yeah. You're supposed to get noticed. I do a pretty primo job of just. Laying down the laying down the law here. <laughs> Except for right there and I met but it doesn't matter. Cause Max just blows that shit up anyway. Another spectacular explosion. So here's the guy I gotta meet that knows the location of the 
death camp or whatever. More of these amazing facial animations. <laughs> Yep, so he's like, oh, you need some booze and women. <laughs> but that's... I'm told you know the that's not what we came here for. Yes, I'm afraid so. I wish that I would never lay eyes on a terrible place again. The ghosts of Vladik's victims demand justice. That is the reason we are here, yes? Yep. That in a briefcase full of Sorry for the silence. I, I, I was just trying to listen to... Listen to the yeah, spectacular no. voice acting. Like Most people will try and listen to That's why I'm being quiet, too. So but... Collect your money and get back to your busy social life. Say no more. Follow me. So that's the end of this level. Two very short levels that we just did. So I guess it's time to blabber on about things you blabber on about. Blabber. I actually don't really have much to talk about this time. <laughs> what did we talk about? What did we get to start talking about last time? Um, I think we were just making fun of the game. What? Those explosions. You, you'd think they'd be a little more worthwhile. Like, oh boy, here's some C4. Oh, let's, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wiki. Sniper Ghost Warrior 2. See. Go for it. Sniper, this is the Wikipedia page. Okay, it's published by. developed and published by City Interactive for all of the major consoles. There's a whole big thing about the plot, even though no one. no one is, uh. gonna pay attention to it. <laughs> There's DLC for this game, which is a prequel to the original game. What? Because that's something I want to do. Yeah. Quote, I quote this, Sniper Ghost Warrior 2 is a tactical shooter that employs stealth, hand-to-hand -hand assassinations, and titular sniping techniques. <laughs> I wouldn't call them titular. They're just kind of standard. Uh, yeah. I, I guess... I, I don't know. I was going to say jumping from that cliff earlier, but... That's not a sniping technique. That's just jumping <laughs> from the cliff. I know. I'm just saying, like... There's nothing... There's nothing too... I don't know where I'm going with this. But anyways. So the game, yeah, the game has multiplayer. Uh, you, I guess you take... Engage others in sniping duels, which I guess sounds kind of cool, but I can guarantee you no one is playing this game. There might be, but I'm... I doubt it. I'm sure those... it's the people that are, like, super obsessed and super good at it. That's well, usually, like, the niche players that are kind of like, oh, this game is fucking fantastic. I'm going to dedicate my life to this. Uh, no, I don't think that you could get that with Sniper Ghost Warrior 2. Oh, you'd be surprised. So it was released, this was released in a normal retail version in a limited bulletproof steelbook edition that has a soundtrack, <laughs> which the soundtrack isn't remarkable in this game, a booklet of the history of sniping and extra DLC. The history of sniping? Which I guess sounds kind of cool, but it's probably like, you probably learned better on like the History Channel. Probably. Or the worldwide interwebs. Yeah, okay. Aggregating review sites, game rankings, and Metacritic gave the PS3 uh, version 56.5% or 56.50% and 52 out of 100, and the PC version 52.71% and 51 out of 100. So, this game didn't get very good reviews. Accordingly. <laughs> I was about to say... <laughs> because it's all all like 
because they're not very... This is not a very... Good game. Yeah. I mean, it's not terrible, but it does nothing really to... really set itself apart. I'm just, like, glancing over this plot, and this seems about right, but... Like, who cares? <laughs> so, yeah, I, I played the original one way back when. How was that? Better, at least, or...? Sniper, the sequel is a little bit better. I mean, it's... Yeah, it's not very good. Uh, the game is based around the role of military sniper. This is for the original one, which is the developer has noted that the public interest of which has increased thanks to large parts to the shows and channels, like the History Channel, the Military Channel. An exception to this uh, spotting... I don't remember spotting missions, but I guess there were where in the first one where you'd spot, spot targets for a computer-controlled sniper character. I guess that could be fun. So, the, the first game was a lot more open. Not a lot more, but it was like linear but yeah while the routes not followed exactly the level design is usually ensures a linear path but the second game the one that we're what we're doing right now is fairly linear the game itself got a 2 out of 10 from Eurogamer <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm watching. I'm, okay, so I'm watching a video about magnetic uranium, like a, like some from a channel called Periodic Periodic Videos, and the little YouTube ad that comes up is for SemenTanks.com. <laughs> what? what? It's for a website called SemenTanks.com. S e m e n. Semen, yes. SemenTanks.com. Because that is so related to periodic elements. <laughs> what the actual shit? Is it, like, sponsored by it? I don't know. I'm going to go on this site. And... That took me by surprise. I'm like, oh, cool, magnetic uranium. Like, uh, uh, new discovery, I guess. It's just pff, secret tanks. Just like, what? This shit's going on here. This Please. is exactly what you think it's for. Uh... uh... It's exactly... Go, going right now. Go, go mess up. Okay, yeah, you're you're right. Well, I I love the adorable puppies that are on that website uh, down at the bottom. Do you see that? Yeah. A cow, some goats, a horse, and then two adorable puppies. Just kind of... This site's gross. <laughs> Use the free classified action to sell your used see it takes. <laughs> <laughs> Use to sell semen, sell embryos, etc. People who buy tanks are also buying semen. Oh god! I guess no. Uh, I guess it's for like to keep it so you can like impregnate your cow, like your cows to get more cows. Oh, I, <laughs> to get more cows. Like you know, I mean, if you're if you're a farmer and you're like, it's I don't have any bulls or anything, and I need more, I need more cows. Yeah, I mean, or milk or meat or et cetera, Then you gotta get, you gotta get semen. And how are you supposed to transport semen without semen tanks? It's understandable. It's just kind of weird to just kind of throw that on like a video about like elements. I don't know. I guess YouTube monetization really just 
throws anything out there. That's well, was that an ad there. with like from YouTube or an ad from like it's on the YouTube. Yeah, it's on like okay. the YouTube monetized ad. I, I guess they pretty much will just give spots to anybody that's paying them money. Pretty much, or it's Google. <laughs> that was pretty weird, though. This, Anyways, hey, this is some pretty interesting shit, though. Back on to back on to Sniper Ghost Warrior Two. Uh, it was announced and was expected to be released in August 2012, like August of last year. Then it got pushed back to, to October, <laughs> and then it got pushed back again to March 12th of this year. <laughs> so, yeah. And I don't know why, because, I mean, that pushback really didn't help it all that much. <laughs> I hop on that old oh, Xbox 2 while I'm doing this. It... Oh, man. So what, are you, what are your overall impressions of Snapper Ghost Warrior 2? Oh, man. I mean, it it's a good concept. I'm not going to lie. Like They could have they could have done so much more with it. I mean, thus far, I, from what I've seen, it's not like the best it could have been. And, and this was delayed how many times? It was delayed from August of last year to October, and then to what did I say? Like March? Yeah, this. I, I think they really, if it's delayed this long, the cinematics should just look like plain ass. And the whole game shouldn't be plain ass. It just should, yeah. It, they definitely had a, enough time to kind of spruce that up a bit and fix a couple of those issues. Make like things the, not suck. Yeah, like the magical seeing through your scope matrix bullet trail. I'm going to get a picture of that later. It's pretty funny. So I'm on their, I'm on their official website, <laughs> and they're just quoting, they're quoting things from different, like, publications. So... They seem to be like three or four different ones. A fifty caliber rifle can do terrible things to a man, and that's something Sniper Ghost Warrior 2 revels in. What? All of the guns shoot the same, like, the same way. Yeah, and there's the nothing same. like... There's nothing special about the fifty caliber in no. that game. And in addition... Okay, so let's check. But in addition, like, it doesn't really do anything... Like, it doesn't, like, take off limbs. It just oh. acts like all the other snipers. It's just a little louder, and I don't think that... Is it ever silenced in this game? No. It's just, it's just louder. <laughs> I, I guess whoever wrote that just, just likes loud bangs. I'm, I'm assuming. What is this? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. What? Is What's it? going on? So there's there's a link on the on the. I'll just show you what I'm at right now. Okay. There's a link. I'm just gonna explain. There's a link for anyone still listening. Where on on the official web page it says "Snipe your monitor, design your cabinet." So you click on it, and it brings you to the site that I just linked you to, where you can choose like the color of your. It just shows you a monitor. Right? Oh, this is loading so slow, but yeah. yeah. It's, what'd you expect, though? Like, yeah, I mean, yeah. You can choose, it shows you like a monitor, then you can choose your color, so I'm going to go with red. I'm going to go to texture, and you can just choose these weird, like, all these, like, camo weird textures for, like, a monitor. <laughs> so right now I have, like, rock, it's like a rock texture. You can choose like a camo texture, and it's like this see like this computer rendered monitor. Let's to get your thing out of the way here. So here's some bricks, like bricks or metal bricks. <laughs> oh, I'm not even halfway loaded yet. Oh, that's embarrassing. But 
Let's find the weirdest. Here's some dots. I, I don't know what you're talking here. about. Here, oh. Oh, oh, just, man. just, just wait. Just, I'll, I'll wait. This is pretty ugly. A sti- or get some stickers. Sweet. <laughs> Sniper Ghost Warrior Two stickers. I'm putting up like a blood splotch. I would actually really love to know how much money they've made off of like their stickers and stuff. Probably nothing. no. It's not like a. I don't think this is an actual like thing. Like thing, saleable. Yeah. S- no, saleable. it's just you just design it. So let's get. I would. I put the dude on here. Put Anderson on there. Let's get some blood splotches. Oh yeah, this looks pretty sweet. Okay, sweet so left out. Let's see if let's see what else we can put here. Stickers. Let's go back to these other pages. Stickers. Sniper, go put that rig right here, right there. I can make it smaller, so I'll put that like on the base. Put this sweet, sweet ass pistol on like the neck of this thing. <laughs> so we rotate it. L. Yeah, we can rotate it. I need to fix this texture because this texture is dumb as hell. <laughs> I don't. I try. I was trying to make the worst one possible, but this is <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, oh, you're just oh. Yeah. See what I mean? <laughs> what? Should you put any image on here? What is this? Preview. Snipe your monitor. <laughs> what is this? Let's publish this bitch. Oh, man. Abrasive on the eyes pink with camo. Oh, but now this isn't going to load either for like five... Oh, God, now the camouflage. i got to wait for this to load. Why did I click this, Mitch? Because <laughs> I told you to. No, so, okay, I didn't... Like, they give you a, ch- a list of countries to choose from. <laughs> Bel- Belig... Belgeek, Czech-, Czech Republic, Deutschland, France, Netherlands, Österreich, which is Austria... Poland, two. One of them is Russia, and one of them has got to be Poland or Russia and Ukraine, I think. And then United Kingdom. Let's choose United Kingdom. I wish no, it did. I don't want to subscribe to your newsletter. They make you subscribe to the newsletter. <laughs> so I guess I'm subscribing to their newsletter now. So let's hop onto my email and see what I get for snipping my monitor. I should not have used my school email. <laughs> uh, oh, if uh, you just des- if you design the thing, you can win win stuff. Oh. Based on the artistic value and creativity of the designs, the Iyamama jury, the Iyama. Yeah, I, I don't know what that is. I, that's apparently the company. Yeah. Ju- choose five winners to be worded with one, a 27 inch monitor, pro light bead, move the airbrush according to the winning design. Oh, man. Alienware PC, PC game of Sniper Ghost Warrior 2 Deluxe Edition, Iyama, and Sniper Goodie Bag. <laughs> so if my, if my design, my horrible design wins, I win a monitor that has this on there. <laughs> like I ugh. You might I, I, hope I, my wait, I hope no one else like that's what I was about to say like, I think you might win by default I, yeah, I, hope, I hope no one else entered into this contest so <laughs> I win this like god awful monitor I'm gonna have to enter too if we win this we, we're definitely gonna have to make like a follow up video like well we actually won this horrible looking monitor <laughs> I don't think you were like uh, how to no. share this with someone I really want to share this with someone because it's so like screen cap screen cap and throw it up as the image for the oh fuck oh, throw it up as the image um 
after the uh, video. It's... But then you have to save and encode the video with that on it. I pretty much designed the back. It's got like the the picture of the dude walking on it, and then like some blood splatter that says Iyama. And then on the base, like when you look at it, it says Sniper Two. Sniper <laughs> Two. And there's like a picture of a pistol on like the neck of the monitor. <laughs> I honestly hope I win this. I can have the ugliest monitor in the world. <laughs> so, our, our second, second place gets a 24-inch monitor. But when is this done? Like, when are they doing this? It ends Ju- June 30th. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> I don't think anyone knows in the first place. Yeah. Oh boy, I'm at 92% for this sticker, because this sticker took five minutes to load. Oh, but, uh, so the second place is a 24-inch mod that looks like your, looks like your winning design. Uh, I, NVIDIA graphics card, the game, and Yama and Snipe goodie bags. And then pretty much from then on, uh, you just get the same 22-inch monitor, a graphics card and the game and the goodie bags. So let's go on to their Facebook page where that has 829 likes. <laughs> you know so what, hopefully Hello? there's not, there's probably not much competition. Probably Yama, not. Yama just makes commute computer monitors. Uh, I mean, I've never heard of them, so... Neither have I. It, it, in well, all I, I honesty... I win and get this, like, this awful, god-awful monitor that I, I'd be, that I'd, I made. I'd, like, give mine away. <laughs> no! You know what I'd do if I won this? I, w- I, would, I would take this to Arizona with me and actually snipe my monitor. So if you're listening, if you're listening, then I-, I will like, I will make a video, Iyama or whatever your name is. I will make a video. You could, I will post your logo all over the screen while I'm doing this, and I will take like a, I will get a slow motion camera and snipe the monitor if you give me one. Rent, like get a 50 cal and be like, hey, can I will literally blast rent the shit out of this. I will move. I will fly back to Arizona, rent a 50 cal, and snipe my monitor. And, so the 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 prize is a Alienware be. computer, but it's the M17X, which is a laptop. <laughs> <laughs> they make actual laptops, not just monitors. No, Alienware makes them. Alienware makes laptops. And oh, like, Alienware! Oh, I'm yeah. sorry, I thought you were talking about Yama. Oh, not, not Yama. I'm like, <laughs> don't know if I want that. Uh, it looks like it's got a 680 680M. I'm not sure if that's good or not. I don't think I've ever heard that used before in my life. Well, it's it's what's the M stand? It's line of like mobile graphics cards. Oh well, I, I wouldn't know about mobile anything. Yeah, it's a fifteen or one thousand four hundred ninety nine dollar computer or laptop. Oh, my image is too big to load. What? Your internet's like balls, dude. No, it's not even my internet. It's just, I don't know what it is about this web page. Uh, give me no, I'm gonna, that, too. I'm putting a custom image on this thing. I've got some images I can use. De- if, if I actually win this, I'm just going to be like, yeah, 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 I did that. They give you sample designs. No, I'm putting something else on there. They give you sample designs on, like... I'm like the on the page. Are they any good? Not really. <laughs> like it's like a broken glass motif with like two bullet holes in the like as a decal, and then a sniper ghost warrior two is on the bottom. Line. Like they're not that great. Mine has a chance of winning just like any of the other ones. So they're all pretty much garbage anyway. So I can't rotate my design. I I can't. I 
Okay, so the picture I'm adding is at like I would say let me think. It's at like a hundred and forty five degree angle. It's not even like straight. I good good job. I'm just gonna put that right there. So promotion buy a twenty four inch pro light uh, Yamamata, register your purchase and get Sniper Ghost Warrior PC game for free. Is that really your incentive? I'm gonna screen cap this one for you. Just just enjoy this beauty. Is that really their incentive? Like, buy this game or buy this monitor and you get this awful game for free? <laughs> oh oh wow okay. So I what? put the decal of sniper sniper two. I'm gonna swear you're two. When on the bottom, it's in the reverse. So like I don't know. This is this is a mess of a thing, really. <laughs> Okay, so this this is supposed to be like this is supposed to be turned like a hundred some. Uh, it's supposed to be turned to the left a lot. It, it's it's just fucked up, and that's how it gave me like that's how it imported my picture with no option to rotate that at all. I'm gonna just upload a random image. Just upload random like this is. This this is just like a no. I don't want to put it there. Okay, now that looks shitty. But choose image. I'm going with the TARDIS. The TARDIS. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna go with. Uh, oh no, you can rotate it. How? Uh, J and L. Oh. I gotta do that over again. <laughs> Let's just make the worst thing I possibly can. Boom. That's gonna be there. Hurries. If I if I actually got this monitor, I I don't know if I'd actually. <laughs> it's a free monitor, even though I've made this the ugliest thing possible. I put you know you know uh, did you play yeah you played New Vegas right yeah. I put yes man on the <laughs> I hope to God, like What did you title yours? Like the I think like the bestest thing or something like that. So the TARDIS is now on my on the thing. Like, make it, like, the least related related to Sniper Elite 2 possible. I'll put some stickers on this, put a Claymore on the bet. Mitch, if you haven't looked at my image, I'm gonna, all I'm going to say is furries. Mm-mm-mm. If If I win. Oh, wait. Choose country. I guess America isn't one? Nope, United Kingdom. Well, I could technically ask one of my UK friends to ship that to, <laughs> ship that to me. <laughs> this ugly ass pink color. Yeah. Oh, you looked at it. Yep. <laughs> if they actually do that, I I, I would. I, um, I can't really tell what kind of furry shit you put on the bag. Hold, but... hold on, I have a better version. It's. I, a... I don't think I want to see. No, hang on. It's 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 nothing ridiculous, Mitch. Oh, face. yeah. Yo, nut. Oh, or else can, oh. What? You can, you can adjust the screen height and the tilt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this ridiculous man on here. Here, this is, this is the original image. I'm going to make this like the worst thing I possibly can. I guess I'm going to save as open file. Oh. Yeah. Okay. That, that's me, by the way. <laughs> sure, that looks that looks a whole lot like you. <laughs> no, I, I didn't actually. Um, I, I wasn't the one that gave the description for that, so that was like, oh, thanks, I guess. That's not close. I'm gonna make this the worst thing I possibly can.
Do it. Put the, put the uh, prostate exam picture on it. <laughs> no, I just, want, I just want a chance of maybe winning. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> uh, well, mine submitted. I gotta submit another one to a different email address, because I don't think there would be one twice. <laughs> Knowing this webpage, they might let you do it twice. This is honestly god awful. I don't know who who would actually like agree to like make this. Yeah. I think Ayama themselves might maybe they're just some like random foreign based like hey let's we we just like custom airbrush these monitors for people. And like we've never heard of them. Well, cuz it's from Europe land. Yeah. Like Where, I put you know, this part like like so bad. We're wanting a custom airbrushed back of your monitor that you're never going to look at. <laughs> Where that apparently is a thing. I don't I mean I mean I guess you could justify this if you go to like land parties like all the time with like you know those you big can zoom. Ones. I know, I know. These I just... decals are awful. Yeah. And hey, you see the little uh Oh god. The little like uh actual Iyama monitor sticker on the back of it there. <laughs> yeah, I think that's just there so you know. I know, it's just, I I just think it's funny. Anyways, let's see this. Well, either way, you're getting it at the very least if you win at fifth place, you're at least getting a twenty two inch monitor. Mine Which I is... think is mine's twenty four right now. That's still bigger than any of these two that I have. I mean, it's better than nothing. If I mean, and plus you get you get this amazing game. You'd be like, hey guys, look at this let's play we did of your of this amazing game. I'll give us. Not gonna prize. lie, I I I just like throw it away. Why? It's a, it's a free monitor. No, not the, oh, the monitor. Game. The game. <laughs> the game. I'd be like, oh yeah, okay, thanks. <laughs> thanks for this awful, awful like this subpar game. I'd, pro- I'd probably just sell it, honestly. Now I'm just finding places to put things. Yeah, this is this is just Europe land company. World leading manufacturer of computer monitors. Right. Define world leading. Efficiency, performance, reliability, and user comfort are all key to the development of Ayama projects or products. Mm. I don't know about Let's that. Let's get another sniper in this thing. <laughs> you should just put like a hundred of them in there. Just put like make a little battle of just like hundreds of snipers on one side and hundreds on the other. Like, yeah, I spent that much time doing this. You'd probably win if you spent that much time. I like how almost all of these. Is this guy are even in the game? Impression. One guy, oh. <laughs> this, like, black guy, who's just like, hey, look at this guy I have. Like, look, here you go. Copy image URL. Look at that. That's on their Facebook. Just do, just doing that to monitors, you know. Because that's well, so important to do. Well, that actually looks kind of cool if you really wanted that. It, I mean, I'm saying, like, if you really wanted that, that's great. But I'm just saying, like... I'm just finding ways to make this worse and like, like, ugh. Ugh. Like, I'm um, just, we're over the top bad. <laughs> yeah, a lot of these designs are pretty. Let's add another blood splotch. Actually, no, let's go for, let's go for this. Anyways, man, good luck. <laughs> good luck on your monitor. 
Let's see if I can zoom out and... Here's here's the hoping that we both win at least a 22 inch. Right. I'm gonna, take, I'm gonna show you some screen caps. I f- I don't know if you can like remove a stencil or anything. So right now there's just like this white splotch of where I fucked up putting a stencil. But I'm just gonna. I guess I'm just gonna print screen or something. Put it into paint and then save it into. I guess we can crop. Or croppers. It'd be, it'd be so funny if I won, though. Like, not even trying. Like, we're the only two people yeah. to, people to enter this thing. <laughs> oh my! Oh my! Xbox just did. It just goofed. What did it do? Oh, uh, I clicked the dashboard button, and then like the dashboard like thing, like the you know the 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 Xbox thing came up and then it disappeared the screen dimmed again and now I can hear the boop 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 in the background as I move my controller but there's nothing booping on screen strange good good job Microsoft again I've actually been, well then again I did drop my Xbox <laughs> Are you, do you still want to keep recording this, or did you want to... Yeah, I'll keep on going. I don't have to go get food for a little while. <laughs> I'm just going to make an Imgur gallery just to show you, like... Okay. Do we... So I'm being like a cheaty McCheat pants on Modern Warfare 2, because I, I know people's... But this son of a bitch isn't, like, inviting me. I don't want to unlock all my goddamn attachments again. Again, you know? But you don't play Call of Duty, so... No, I really don't. You don't You don't know the pain of... having to do all of that over again. Here we go. I'll send this, this link to you now. Please do. <laughs> Just... Just looks like a twelve year old just kinda put things everywhere. <laughs> I really hope I win. <laughs> it's just a TARDIS. Uh, <laughs> look, I really hope I win just so I can have this like awful monitor to, like look what I won. I designed <laughs> this, I don't like <laughs> <laughs> I just put a knife down the center. Like their decals are even aren't even like good. Like how they did them, they're still yeah. like jaggies and stuff. I just a little tiny little tiny sniper decal on the top. Not like god awful texture. I guess I'll put a link to this maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I don't. I don't know if anyone's gonna get this far in the video to actually make use of it. <laughs> this be sniper goes over here elite and an image of this god awful monitor. You know, image go for it because that would, I think would be even better. Just this god awful monitor with no explanation. <laughs> oh man, I I do genuinely hope we both win our monitors. Also, like, in all seriousness, if you do genuinely win that, I do know someone that we could, like, send them an address of, and he'd probably ship it to us. Since we put UK down as our country. (laughs) (laughs) Which is funny enough, as is. 
Well, it's a, it's a, I guess it's a European country. I know. Or a why, European maker. Why would it, why would it, I mean, I guess it's self-explanatory. It is Ghost Warrior. But why would you go with, like, like, was it, is that company exclusively in Europe or something? The, the, I think the, maybe, because I've never heard of them. The one that builds us, the, the, or builds us, <laughs> the one that made the uh, game. Like, well, City Interactive? Yeah, like, you, like, of all things to not include, like, you, you do a promotional thing for a company that doesn't ship to the U.S. Okay, for the, Wiki, the Wikipedia of Ayama says, Ayama Corporation is a manufacturer of high-end computer monitors, medical monitors, te- and televisions named after the city of Ayama in Nagano, Japan. Well, that's Japan. They should ship to the U.S. Unless they get some... That's a Japanese company. What about the... I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm the only one sitting here thinking, like, that's a little a little weird. The company was founded in 1973 by Kazuro Katsuyama and has worldwide approximately 1,000 employees, including about 30 in Germany. <laughs> in 2010, the company introduced two miners with LED backlight. Oh, boy. Wait, don't miners already have backlights? Mm-hmm. So what was the point? I don't know. Yeah. World's le- I don't know about world's leading, though. Y- yeah. But... Large format displays. Let's take a look at their product lines. Oh, they're just regular monitors, I guess. Yeah, they're just regular monitors. And TVs and shit. Oh, here we go. Hold up. I'm gonna message this other guy because fucking gotta do that. But in the end, I guess it's Iyama's decision on who wins or not. I get. I mean, they're gonna have to like look at that and be like, "Well, <laughs> no." Oh, yeah, these miners have overdrive. Oh, man, because that's necessary. When very fast graphics are displayed, your monitor can sometimes get blurry. (laughs) Turning on the overdrive feature will will eliminate that. (laughs) I don't know what they mean by that, but okay. Now, where do I where can I go to see if I actually if I actually want to buy this? I don't know, but is there any like could you just buy your um? Let's go to buy. Oh, find resellers and distributors. I wonder if they just do. Uh... I wonder like I wonder if they do they like just do customized. No, they have regular monitors. I think oh, this okay. is just for a uh, just for Striper Elite. Or Sniper Ghost Warrior 2. Because, you know, them promos. Mm-hmm. Promo from a, from a company that no one's heard of for a game that no <laughs> one's going to play. Always got to do something to promote. So, I mean, this game. Just this, this game. Most warrior. So if this is gonna be here, but if wait, what is this? Whatever this. Oh, that's what I named that. Uh, what do you want to do when we're done with this game? Because that this the end of this game is gonna come soon. Because this game is not. Yeah. Like a I not- mean, I, I'm open for anything. I mean, if you if you want to just keep doing this like tandem commentary, I mean, I'm cool with that because it's it's fun. Just gotta figure out a game to play. Yeah, I mean, what? Bio- Bioshock Infinite? Is that just online, or is that like story? Is that no, story? no, that's it's it's a single player only game. Okay. I mean, it it it's up to you. I mean, it might might take a while since like, uh, it's not like cut into levels. It's pretty much just. 
Yeah, not. Nah, it might take a while to do. It's up to you, Mitch. It's it's your videos on your channel. Fallout New Vegas. Hey. A game that that'll, that'll take like twenty hours to play. If you want. So I'm just trying to think of games that won't take like a year to play <laughs> play through. It's it's unfortunate that I don't have like a Sniper Ghost Warrior One. Yeah. I was trying to think of a game that might be, like, fun to talk on. Because <laughs> there's uh, not much to say about games. We're like, oh, this game is fun. Like, yeah. That's, that's true. interesting. But... You just, I don't know. I mean, you could just do comments. I mean, it, I know it would just end up probably us just talking about stuff then, you know? Yeah, like, there wouldn't it, be much to like, say. What are some like really bad games that it would be like fun to play though? Yeah, um, that already that haven't already been like overdone. Yeah. Huh. I think I can record emulators too. I was about to say we might might want to turn to emulation for that because I don't really know that many good bad games. <laughs> Charlie's Angels for the Nintendo GameCube. Oh, God. Oh, God. That game just looks awful, though. So funny. That dance, Lucy. The dance. Who knows? Maybe we can get farther than John did. Who knows? I'm just trying to think of things that we could... I mean, we're getting a little bit ahead of ourselves, but... Yeah. I don't think that's, time. that's too much of an issue, since this game, like I said, is is not a novel long. It's fairly reasonable, I suppose. I'm just looking through the, 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 the Steam games I have that have a narrative, but are also... Yeah, I know what you mean. That are they're going to be kind of fun to commentate over. And there's not only one that I see. Do you know of any like so like so ridiculous? They're fun, uh, like GameCube games or something. I I don't really know too many. I mean, the, GameCube games in general are kind of just like hit and miss. I know games like uh like Aquaman or uh, Charlie's Angels. Yeah, we could always do those. <laughs> embarrassingly bad games. Since for some reason or another, my uh, uh, campus internet actually lets me get on, like, ISO zone and stuff. Oh. Even though it's, I guess, it's technically piracy. Mm. Yeah, it's technically piracy, because, like, no one's going to go after you for it. I mean, it's, I guess technically it is, yeah, but it, it's, some of these things are from companies that don't even exist anymore, and like, the, the companies that would go after you to begin with wouldn't even see a dime of this at this point anyways, because the only place you'd be getting these games from is like a third party, you know. Yeah. They wouldn't see money from it, so you'd be kind of a dick if you sued me for yeah, like. Yeah, Nintendo's not gonna go NES after game. one. 
go after anyone for like downloading a like Super Mario Brothers. Well, actually, well, actually, they might old because games aren't even aren't even like you can't do it. It's uh, it's like um, it's not like public domain, but it's it's open for like archival. So like a website like the ISO Zone, it's it's legal to do that. It's just you, it's kind of this trust deal between like the website and the people downloading where it's like do you, do you own this game because you, you really should only be doing this for backups these are kind of archival oh mm. yeah but no, no one's gonna be like oh you just downloaded so I'm, going, you know, like, I'm, I'm on the iso zone right now i'm scrolling through the, the like pc games yeah and i already found one that might be somewhat entertaining <laughs> 911 paramedic <laughs> <laughs> yeah that sounds pretty <sighs> Interesting. We should check out what I'm still. God damn, I'm still waiting for the new Top Gear. It's kind of. Here are some. Oh. Okay. This looks kind of weird, but this might be. <gasps> Area Fifty One. How was that? I never got around to playing that back then. I'm, I'm. It's you know it's an arcade game, right? The old, oh, oh, wait, oh that is, one. It's a first-person game. Yeah, I'm like, no, Area 51 that that was like on consoles wasn't that was, game. That was kind of shitty, if I remember right. Yeah, that that looked like kind of goofy. So there was a there was a I think there was a sequel or something like Black Side Area 51, and it was kind of a piece of shit. Yeah. Oh, backyard football. <laughs> Bad day, L.A. Boulder's Gate. Don't they still sell Boulder's Gate, though? I think. I don't know. Uh, oh, sweet Barbie's makeover. <laughs> Battle chess. Anyways, man, I, I think I'm probably going to head off now. Okay, if you don't want this to be like... It's t- it's two hours long as is. Oh no, we had, we had some conversation before the. That is true. That is true. <gasps> Big rigs over the road racing, but that's been done. That that game is just done. a pile of dicks. That game sucks so much, dick. <laughs> There's Bioshock on like on ISO Zone, so that's gotta be. I I tested it. It does work. It's pretty good. That's a blatant piracy, though. Well, what we do is uh, games after 2007. There was a big snafu when uh, FIFA 13 came out for the PS2, and people were like, oh my god, it's it's on PS2, though. It's like, no, 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 that's not retro. That's this is 2013 in the title. That's that's uh, that is PS2. But that game just came out, and it's. A current gen game. Yeah, it's true, but I mean, it's it's still. <laughs> it is a lot of like gray area. The whole the whole subject is just kind of gray area. I'm just kind of looking through things to. How about we go to six thirty, then we end. Okay. This is right. This. <laughs> Call of Duty. Call of Duty Two. Oh man! I mean, they, they, we've got a plethora of options. I mean, we've we've got the world in our hands. Case of the crabs. <laughs> could, could you elaborate a little more about that game? Is like, this please? a game? Please. No, it's not. Is this a puzzle game? No, it's not. Is this a mystery game? The answer is yes. In this black and white noir game, you play Nick Bounty, a public M private eye detective who is trying to solve a case, but not just a case. It's a case of the crabs. <laughs> <laughs> I think we should play that. <laughs> I, I that, that game has my vote. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna download this right now and see what it. <laughs> that's my vote. <laughs>
<laughs> Let's play a case of the crabs. <laughs> so I see Isozone got a new like download thing. Oh yeah, we um we we're not hosting locally anymore. Apparently it sucks balls, but I don't even download from there anymore. Cloud stores. Yeah, it's... Cloud store. yes. I just clicked download file, and I'm just kind of waiting, because I really want to see what the case of the crabs is. <laughs> like, I'm going gonna, gonna to just copy and paste this description. Oh, go for it. Oh, man, let's read this. <laughs> <laughs> The case of the crabs. There we go. It's a seven seven point five meg file, so I got four minutes. That's uh, just the case. You can case boot it up crabs. within the time. <laughs> <laughs> you can boot it up within the time and see what happens. <laughs> What'd you say? Maybe like it'll download within an appropriate amount of time, so. It can start up and give a little preview. Oh, I I don't even like want to look up YouTube videos of it. I just want I just want like my first experience of the game to be like, whenever you finish recording. <laughs> I'm assuming we're gonna go ahead with this one. Well, if it's any good or not, it's got to be good. I it's hope it's got to be it's... worthwhile. We I hope might it might have something like, or I hope it works. We we might have just found out like a hidden gem. <laughs> of case of the crabs. <laughs> Hopefully, it's just not some person's like shitty flash game. Yeah, that would be kind oh, of. Oh, Tagatana. But that's been done. Like a lot. Have you heard of Daikatana? Y- yeah, I, I just said that's been done quite a oh, bit. Oh, yeah. Okay, I thought you were talking about. I just kind of. You just kind of goofed kind of, out there. It's yeah, okay. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I need to find this this RAR file though. Maybe it's in my downloads folder. Is it done already? Yet. Yeah. Wait, how big was the game? Like seven point five megabytes. Yeah. Yeah, that might be a. Goofy game. Oh, I'm gonna open it. Oh, it's just a... Okay. What? What oh. is it? Oh, wow, okay. Not, not anything worthwhile? This is... I don't... Like, Fraps doesn't rec... Actually, no, I think Fraps might recognize it. No, it doesn't. I'm going to take a look. Look at Crab. Yeah, this is someone's, like... Oh. Really bad. That's unfortunate. Shoot Crab. I'm going to shoot the Crab. Shoot the Crab, goddammit! Well, that's unfortunate. Get get knife. Use knife on crab. No, this game is dicky. This game sucks. <laughs> yeah, we're not gonna play this. Okay. Unfortunately, unfortunately, it was worth nothing. Well, darn. I'm dis- the name. I'm disappointed personally that. A case of the crabs wasn't anything to laugh about. It's just like a, a shitty flash game that someone made. Well, dick. <laughs> Deftones, White Pony. What's up? That's just a game. Deftones, White Pony. Huh. Let's open it. Oh, it's a Deftones of... Deftones tribute to retro gaming. <laughs> so I found this game that I used to have on a Xbox. What is it? Dead Man's Hand. 
Oh, how was that? As I remember, not very good. Oh. But I mean, I, it's been a while. It might be decent. Yeah. I mean, it was on the original like Xbox. Yeah. Deus Ex. That's piracy because they still days they still sell Deus Ex. They have Diablo. Die by sword. <laughs> oh, hey, a hentai game. Not delicious. Gonna play that one. Dora the Explorer Backpack Adventure. Dragon Ball vs. Street Fighter Mugen. Oh, Mugen is like a Mortal Kombat sort of like thing that you can import any kind of like character sheets for. So people like to do that because it's like, I can play as anything. A bunch of Duke Nukems. Uh, Earth from Gym 1 and 2, even though... I'm, no, I don't have it. Oh, is this what I think it is? Yeah. What? Eight-Legged Freaks, the game of the movie. <laughs> F ethnic cleansing. Oh, boy. Oh, ethnic cleansing, the game? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that... Yeah, that's not... Yeah. Uh, it's I've shitty. seen someone play it, and it's like a really bad game. It's a bad game. Like, not even bad as in, like, uh, offensive or anything. It's yeah, just it's like, poorly made. Uh-huh, pretty much. I'm not gonna go ahead and say it could have been better. <laughs> like, <laughs> they could have made it better. They could they could have made it better, but that's that's kind of a kind of an awkward thing to say. Oh, pure, is, is a pure gameplay-wise, like, opinion, they could have done better. Yeah. Disregarding the... The subject matter. The the incredible racism. Like, have you seen, um... I, I've seen it, yeah. Like, gameplay videos of it, of like, like oh, that's offensive, but like, who can't... Like, it's like... It's uh, like white like, supremacist like, offensive. Like, like, oh, we're gonna call you monkeys, like... No one, no one, no one does that. But like it's the racist. deep south, you laugh at it. You're like, yeah. oh, that's racist. You're not like, oh, I am deeply offended by this racism. You're like, that's that's adorable. Like, look how racist this is. <laughs> Let's play this for shits and giggles. <laughs> so ISO Zone's rule is like, if it came out within us before a certain time. Pretty much, yeah. 2007 or earlier. Because Halo... Hell Cab! Hello Kitty Cutie World. Hip Hop EJ5. I don't know what those are. We've got a lot of those uploaded, though. Of just like weird games that no one remembers. I think it's just like a like a music making kind of like game or something. I don't know. Cause I hope. I mean, if I download any of these, I hope they work with like uh fraps. Oh yeah. JFK Reloaded. <laughs> We can go and play that and laugh at it because I know it's supposed to, like people are supposed to be like offended by it, but like ooh, you're because you're shooting JFK, but King of the Hill game. Maybe. 
Oh, it did not work or even install under Windows 7, so we can't play that. Oh, the Land of the Dead game is such a shitty game. You can probably laugh at that game as... <laughs> laugh at that game with some fun. Do they have Lego Island? I had that game as a kid. No, they don't. So I, I want like a game just to like look at how bad this game is. Zelda Legend of Zelda is a collection PC. The collection PC that includes emulators, DirectX 8, a Zelda game for NES, SNES, and 64 GB DS. Hacks, Zelda Forever, Zelda Return of the Hylian, Desktop Backgrounds, Triforce Font, and more. Whereas, like, where's, where's Faces of Evil and Wanda Gamelon? Who would want those games, though? Like, who would want those awful CDI Zelda games? <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, Marine Sharpshooter 2, Jungle Warfare. That can be continuing on our, our games of shitty games that that do something. Microsoft, Microsoft, Microsoft. I remember way like what is it, is a topic of conversation way at the end of this of this whatever this is. What was the first game you ever played? Wait, what was that? I'm sorry. What was the, what was the first game you played? I can't even remember, honestly. It's definitely N64 or Game Boy, but um, I'm sure I'll, I'm sure it was some shitty Game Boy game. Either that, or probably my grandparents. I played uh, Interstate 76 on the old PC, which I, I still play every now and then. But it's it's not it's not too spectacular. It was good for the time. It's a fun like Vigilante 8 sort of game with like a lot more detail as far as like the physics of the. You, like in the attachments of the weapons and shit. That's um, kind of cool. My my parents first got a computer like in I don't know uh, early two thousands. No, not even uh, like probably it had Windows ninety eight, so it was probably early like two thousand, maybe ninety nine, ninety eight. I remember. They they brought it home, or they had it, and then one day they brought home Tomb Raider, but Tomb Raider wasn't the first game I played. They brought home Tomb Raider, and they couldn't play it because it didn't work. But the first game I played was a game that I believe came with Windows 98 that was like a motorcycle game, like a motorcycle racing game, and it was like really colorful. And... It had, like, really weird sound effects, and I remember it, but I don't remember what it was called. And I don't... I've never been able to find it, like, ever, <laughs> and, and I'm kind of disappointed. But the first, like, game game that I owned was Jazz Jackrabbit 2, or played was Jazz Jackrabbit 2. Yeah. And I, I, mean, I still have the same disc. So that's neat, I guess. <laughs> but, like... The first boss used to scare the shit out of me, because I was, like four or five, maybe. <laughs> and, like, the game is way too hard for me just because, you know, I was, like, five. So I had to use cheats. All very, you know, whatever. Nine one one. I kind of want to play nine one one paramedic because that might be funny. Maybe. I mean, go, go if it's not you know ridiculous download time. Go for it. I think, but I think it might be like just oh, um, gotta get rid of case of the crabs because that game sucked. Oh, it's uh, it's two parts total download is one point eight gigs. So it's a game. 
It's a game game, yeah, but it, like... Do you want to dedicate that much time to it? Oh, to a download? For... It doesn't matter. I mean, it, it'll, it won't take a while because I'm on, like, school internet, but... Yeah. Like, take a look at these, uh... Oh, it's CD one. None of mine. I don't see one or two, but I don't know. It might be just be the first disc. But like, take a look at these screenshots. I mean, it looks like I don't know. It looks like from the nineties. I'll check this out. That's <laughs> a pretty shitty looking game. I don't. I don't think so. <laughs> he wouldn't be interested in like making fun of this. I mean, yeah, I mean, go for it. I wouldn't. Oh god, this is funny. Oh, like how the paramedic just sits in the same position every time. I think it's in quick time. It might not work. Yeah, it's in quick time player. So we'll, we'll skip this. Okay. It looks kind of funny though. When did Oblivion come out? I don't know. Before 2007. Cause it, yeah, because yeah, ISO Zone has the, the goatee of Oblivion. Yeah. Which oh. is kind of weird. Pajama Sam. What? Pajama You never play Pajama Sam? Oh, man, I'm getting tired now. Well, I haven't. Oh, I used to play that game all the time as a kid. That's like what we had. <laughs> Peter was... Jackson is King Kong official game of the movie Gamers Edition. Putt putt. Putt putt goes to the zoo. I had all of those games <laughs> as a kid. And then I remember, like, I don't know why I remember this, but one day, like, me and my sister is like, well, if, since you know they're on PC, and they're like, well, if it's on, if it's on a CD, it'll work with the PS2. <laughs> Not fully understanding how things worked. No, I, I I had a similar not understanding thought. I was like, oh boy, the new Xbox is coming out. I wonder if it's going to have compatibility for my Game Boy. <laughs> 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 not understanding that they're very very different things. Where, you get like, where does the cartridge go? Yeah, I, re- I remember my grandparents getting the Xbox and just looking at it like, oh, there's nothing but CDs. <laughs> well. There's like CD. Well, actually, yeah, you could put your previous like, CDs in there. You could put your CDs in there, but it just was so bad. The original Xbox, so bad. Had an 8 gigabyte hard drive. Good luck putting all your CDs on there. Let alone, the only time you can listen to it is if you weren't playing a game. No, some games allowed it, though. Nope, not on the original. Yeah, yeah. Which, I mean, they, oh, it allowed you to, to play the game, the music that was, like, saved on the Xbox. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Some, like, uh, Project Gotham Racing. Yeah, yeah you're right. Those are the racing games. Very few, though. Few I know. Did. So I, I just remember, like... It's not like the 360 where you can just do that with whatever. Yeah, when you're in the 360, when you first realized you could do it, you're like, holy shit, I can just play it over all these things. That's all. That's always fun. Read a, ra- read a rabbit, motherfucker. I remember this. Do they have Spy Fox? Spy Fox? It was in the line of... Pajama Sam and Putt Putt. I think they were made up, made, up, made by all the same company. Oh. Well, they're just educational games, and it was like a it was a parody of James Bond. Oh, that's kind of cool. Stalker Stalker Complete 2009. Huh. Mm-hmm. Wanna wanna go ahead and link me to that? Oh, I, I got I got this right here. Hang on. Stalker Elite. Seal of Evil. Uh, how does how do you how do you s dot t dot a dot l dot K, dot is stalker. Okay. Stalker. Sheep, dog, and wolf. That. And of course, it's it's not going to show up for me. What the dick? And this is for PC or Xbox. 
Or wait, that was dumb. To see. Uh, that was a dumbass question. Let's go to S. Here. Uh, well, I'm not gonna have to question that because that's uploaded by the head moderator, so. Who? And curbside pharmacist. He's the, uh, he's the, like, head. Oh, I think, I think what it is, it's a mod. It's a mod, yeah. Yep, yeah, 2007. Yeah. 2007 is the most immersive atmospheric shooter. Okay. It's just... That's uh, right. So I think it has a hat soccer play, because it, it basically fixes the game and makes it better. Hmm. <laughs> Skip to my loops. I'll leave all the slender games. Those games are spooky, though. Yeah. I get su sufficiently spooked. Soul Trap. Space Horse. Do you remember After Dark... Like, after Dark Games, or whatever it was called. Uh, I don't think I played too many of them. The Flying Toasters? I don't know. We used to have that. I think that was our, like, screensaver. I don't even have a screensaver anymore. <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> My thing just goes to a black screen. Yeah. Uh, I, I, just, I just don't see the point in a screensaver. Just, 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 just turn my monitor off, man. Well, I just put my monitor on, but... Yeah, I I did that until I burned an image into my screen one day when I stayed up all night. Recently. <laughs> uh, how'd you get it to go away? I just turned off... I just turned everything off and just let it, like, rest for, like, another oh. five hours, yeah. But I, I had, how like... How do you even know that monitors, like, that can happen anymore? I, well, it's, it's an eight-year-old Dell, like, LCD screen, but... I just remember, like, as a kid, when, like... My friend's house, they used to have a plasma or something TV in their... Not a plasma, it was like a big, a big screen TV in their basement, and his dad would always yell at us if we left it on, because the screen might get burn in. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I remember, the, I remember doing that at one friend's house, too, back in the day. <laughs> I think the worst was going over to this other friend's house that, that actually happened to. He paused his game, left it for like two days... Well, that's what and, you get. Yeah, like I, I don't, I don't see why you just leave it on for two days. You're kind of dumb. But yeah, I remember one time when like we're playing Paper Mario, and my dad's like, "We need to go save the game." I'm like I can't save the game. I'm not at the save point. He's like, "Well, save the game." I'm like, what's well, gonna take a while? <laughs> so you just, and that's when you figured out you could just turn off the TV. Yep. <laughs> And somehow that had, like, never come, like, like, come to mind to do that for some reason, I guess. Like, I could just turn off the TV and the game will stay that way? <laughs> so now I'm, just, I'm going through all the games and just tabbing all the ones that might be of... Of something of interest to play as a joke. I was I was really hoping that like Case of the Crabs would be something worth playing, you know? Something, yeah, like like even if it was like so bad that like it was good, but it wasn't. <laughs> Zelda Mystery of Solars DX. And I reached the end to the thing. ZPC, zero population count. Oh. Oh, wow. What? That's a good... That looks really weird. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that looks really odd.
Oh, that, uh... Marine Sharpshooter 2 Jungle Warfare. That, lo- that looks hard to play, like, to just stare at that screen. Yeah, for, for uh, what you call it? For ZPC, yeah. That, that looks like... Ooh, that last screenshot's just kind of weird. Oh... I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if Marine Sharpshooter 2 Jungle Warfare is anything. I'm downloading it. Oh, if your population count? Yep. I'm it's gonna a, get ZPC. 50 meg download. W- worth checking it out. I don't know what's going on over there. It looks pretty freaky. I, I don't understand why people upgrade their ex- original Xbox processors. It's like the most god awful soldering job, and then on top of that, none of the games are going to use it. <laughs> it. Literally, none of the games are optimized to, like for anything beyond you know. They're not scripted to use anything beyond what the Xbox had. So you, the only point to doing it is for like homebrew games that are like, oh hey look, I'm going to take advantage of this, <laughs> which no one that's making homebrew games <laughs> makes anything worthwhile, you know. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yes, I wanted to mod my console for homebrew. Mm-hmm. Yes. <laughs> yes, that's why it's modded. <laughs> so it's 640. And I gotta go get dinner. If you want, if you want, you can come back and then just talk and make a, make a podcast type thing. We'll see. So just message me when you get back. I, I'll see what I'm doing as far as the Xbox. This dickbag isn't messaging me back. I'm, I'm getting really annoyed. <laughs> well, the guy you fucked with? No, not him. No, I'm I'm being a cheapy cheap cheap on, uh, oh. yeah, uh, what's it called? Modern Warfare 2, like I said. Because I, like, I had Leopard of Snow, and then that account got really screwed up when they didn't let me re-activate like activate my Xbox Live. They suspended me for not being able to pay. Thanks. Yeah, that happens. Thanks, Xbox. But um, anyways, so then um, you know, I was tenth prestige, and then it's like, well, well, now I'm now I'm not even prestiged on this account. So, anyways, someone gave me like an XP lobby for free, and I was like, well, now I don't have my attachments still. And then this guy, this guy, this guy's got his lobby going right now, but he's not inviting me, even though it seems like everybody else on this forum is getting invited, and like. <laughs> posting thanks like two minutes afterwards i'm like sitting here fucking three posts now where it's like i'm i'm still here you still haven't invited me you know th- th- thanks thanks dickbag exactly he's, he's he's not even gonna see this but etc mods 32 you're a dickbag <laughs> come at me bro i just <laughs> i just called you out i called you out on on the part of the let's play that no one's gonna watch. On like the like second hour of like our recording, <laughs> nobody's gonna listen this far into it. You know that, right? I know. I know. Are you gonna still post the whole size though? Yep. Oh man, I just spe- just spectacular. I don't give a shit. Worthwhile. It's Anyways, honest. man. It's it's my let's play. I do what I want. <laughs> let's play two hours of a like thirteen minute game video. <laughs> you know how I roll. <laughs> All right, man. Well, I think I'm gonna end the call. All right, I'll be I'll be back. All right, see ya. See ya.